Welcome back, guys. I understand that, uh, last week I didn't make a video. Uh, that's because where I live, we got some snow, and I went snowmobiling quite a bit, so I didn't really have time. And, uh, I was also trying to figure out how to edit videos better, because I'm not really sure how. But, um, anyways, so I'm going to start this video off a little different. As you can see here, um, 69% of you guys are subscribed, 30% aren't subscribed, and that's pretty good, because the last time I checked, only 30% were subscribed. So, we're going to jump into today's video, and you guys all wanted uh, Farming USA 2 back, so, well, here it is. Um, I was kind of thinking about getting a GoPro for Christmas or something, then kind of just like carrying around out by the farm and filming what I do just about every day. I was on this game a little bit since I filmed last on this game, which was kind of a while ago. And I guess we'll just kind of get started on wheat harvest again. I probably should have played a little more than I did. But, oh well. Um, somebody commented to play Gas 19. I don't know what that is. Is that like, um, a farming simulator? Or is that, uh, some kind of other game? Like, what's Gas 19? Um, so comment down below if you know. Thank you to everyone who subscribed and liked and comments and, yeah. It, it helps a lot when you subscribe So, we're just going to do some more wheat harvesting. We're going to probably go about 30 minutes. And then in the end of the video today, I'm thinking we might look at a house in the town. We're going to take our pickup down there and we're going to look at this nice house I saw. And I'll show you guys the house, yeah. But, uh, I, f I didn't finish field 3. I have still have after field 5, which this field's over about one third done. After I do field, I still have a little in three, field three and the whole field seven to do. So, so what I was trying to do is I was trying to learn how to uh, time lapse the video a little so that you guys didn't have to sit through this like in s kind of slow-mo the whole time because I mean I'm only going six miles an hour which it, it'll get boring after a while and I know that because I'm just trying to figure out how to edit and then put music in it and then after a while and then you guys and then not time lapse it and I, I, I just don't know how to do that. If you know how, comment down below or something. I, I, I just, I don't not want to, I, I just, um, I know it got a little late tonight for the YouTube video except I'm just glad I got one in today because today was my brother's birthday and stuff so yeah. Because... I, I kind of had to get one in this week, so I'll, um, comment down below what you, game I should play next, and don't forget, I will be doing that farming 2019 thing, I'm just having, the, the I'm just having a little difficulties right now, because my sister, she likes to download all kinds of games, like them ads that you might play or see in a game, like in some kind of game, she likes to download from those like those ads in she likes to download those and that takes up a lot of space when you fill up a couple pages of it and yeah so it, it'll be a little bit because I gotta delete some and then she's like oh don't delete that one and then yeah so we're gonna go ahead and drive the dump cart down here real quick speed this up a little Swing that spot up. My brother Dylan, he was gonna play today, except right now he's on the PC playing uh, FS19. Cause uh, Friday night we just built a really nice farm, and it's 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 something that's really nice. So I, I like it. I I built my dairy farm. He built like the greenery. It's really nice, except. 
I'd like to make YouTube videos on it too sometimes. The only problem is I film on a tablet right now, and uh, my the the PC doesn't have a microphone or a camera, so you won't be hearing us or any of that. But if I like get a GoPro for filming up by the farm, you, you then you guys could still I'd probably upload it to the PC and then you guys would watch. But uh, comment down below if that's a good idea for me to carry a GoPro around and show you guys what I do all day, kind of, by the farm. Because I, I kind of do what I'm doing in real life, except we don't got a combine or anything. We, it's a dairy farm, so, uh, yeah. Except I, I do not wreck the tractors. Like, if you, if you didn't see that video I made that one time where I flipped the semi in the ditch... I, I that, nothing like that happens in real life. Others, I'm not sure. I, I'd be making a video right now. I'd I'd probably be in the hospital trying to recover from the last time I tried to drive a semi. So yeah, <laughs> it's probably a good thing I'm not really driving a semi, because I'm not sure it's too legal for a kid to drive a semi down the road. I'm not saying it's a bad thing, but I mean. If you don't know what you're doing, you could really end up doing something wrong, like wrecking something or getting someone hurt. Anywho, let's just keep driving. I'm driving for decades. Once I finish wheat harvest, then I can start doing fun stuff. Like, I'm gonna drive stuff. Like, I might even have my brother Devin on here. Because what he does, <laughs> what he does is he takes, like, the four-wheeler or the track tractor and he just rips that thing thing right through the manure pit like he just drives right through the manure pit like it's nothing or he do you know that big hill that I flipped the semi in if you didn't see that video boy you're missing out because that, that that was just a lot of time wasted on trying to flip a semi out of the ditch but that he likes to take the track tractor or four-wheeler and just like ram it right through the ditch and fly up the hill and yeah so, we're just going to unload the combine. Is it unloaded? Can't tell. Oh, yeah, it is. I couldn't tell because the combine hopper looks full. We're just going to leave this here for now. I have two combines, but if my brother or sister would be helping, or one of my brothers would be helping, then I'd have them... Go ahead and uh, help me with the combining, and they'd probably bail. But if you guys seen my other videos earlier this um earlier, you know I said I was gonna try and put some wheat or soybeans in this field and field four, field five and four. But I'm just gonna plant hay in, in all four of them, and then at the by at the end of this year. Because my silos are... Hold on, how much... This is something you need to check. Okay. Okay, they're good. Um, I was checking how much feed my cows had. But my silo's at 37%. And that's meant to last me until next year, which I don't think it's going to last me till the end of this year. So I'm going to have all four fields hay. And I'm going to try and get a huge hay harvest crew. And we're all just going to like harvest as much hay as I can. Because I just need hay this year. We're going to have a chopper, possibly two, a couple hay biners, and a raker, and yeah. It's, I'm just going to get as much help as I can. And I saw this one comment that he's, uh, he wanted to help play. The, this guy that wanted me to play with him, he said to the next day, except I didn't know exactly what time. And, yeah. And... Um, but, so, yeah. If you hear anything in the background, that might be my, uh, little sister. She's playing on some kind of game. Okay, um, forgot to put in low gear. She's playing on some kind of game that one of my other sisters downloaded. So, we're just gonna keep harvesting wheat. See, if I could time-lapse this, um, 
it, it goes so much faster. So yeah. I think you can hear that noise. Can you guys comment down below if you hear that noise? It's some kind of elephant singing a song. We just got or my sister just got it for like Christmas or something. Or not Christmas. I mean um her birthday. Except uh that that that's all she listens to, like it's one of them things where you like tap the foot and then it plays music or whatever. And yeah. So I'm glad I have this big combine, not that little small one. Because last year on the game, I bought that this combine and that, or not this combine, but this head and that red combine. Because otherwise, I only had that small head, which would take me a long time. Which I don't have that much time, especially when I'm trying to get hay in here as fast as possible. Because I think I'm going to be buying bales this year. I hate to tell you, but I think I'm going to be buying bales. I, I mean, there's nothing wrong with buying bales. It's just, I, I kind of don't like to spend money on that. I, I'd rather spend money on, like, buying grain and fuel. I, I just don't want to see myself buying bales when I have all this land. I, I mean, I literally own every single thing on the map. I'm not sure how to show you. Like, I own everything. If you can tell, it's all planted and growing. And Oh, okay. Okay, field seven. Field 8, that's going to be done soon, and that's barley. we got to get a kicker in gear real quick. Because if that's barley, this is wheat. I have to get the barley off after the wheat. Then i got to plow it all. Then put manure down or spray it. And then get it all ready for next year. And then clean off all my equipment, park it. And then by then I'll have something else to do, I bet. So, we're just going to keep doing... What I've been doing for the last, I don't know, while. So, I kind of want to bail this straw. At the end of this video, comment down below if you think it's a good idea to bail straw. Well, I, it's a good idea to bail straw, except since I'm in such a time crunch, should I do it this year or should I not do it? Like, I kind of want to because then I have more straw. Except, is it a good idea? Because then will I get enough hay? And if I don't get enough hay, then i got to buy the bales, which... It, it's a whole nother th story. Because I could sell the straw bales, except I don't think I will be. So, this field is almost done, at least. Just another... Another roll. And, yeah. Also, there is another solution, though. We will be probably chopping corn this year, which is, that's actually not that bad. It's been, that'd be my first time chopping corn. Otherwise, I always just chopped hay and put it in the silo, so I didn't have to, other, and then I just combined corn, because you can use that for grain. But I'm going to tell you this, I will be chopping corn probably this year. So, Yeah. That means there will be corn chopped, which, uh, it's not a bad job, except it, it just takes a while. It's kind of like this, except I wish you could buy a 12-road corn head. It'd be so much nicer than that little 6-road. But we're just going to go ahead dump, then I guess I'll pause it or something, and then drive out to the next field, which will probably be field 3. Finish that. Head over to field 7, I think. or Yeah, field 7. Go ahead. I hit the dump cart. Yep. Head over to field 7. Start that. I'll probably hopefully have it finished by the next time there's a video. And, well... Anyways. It's the last time I checked, we had 27 subscribers. Now we're at 31, which means we gained about, like, I don't know, five, I'm not counting, so, but, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and, okay, I'm getting stuck, what's the ground moisture, settings, weather, okay, we're almost at 100% ground moisture, no wonder why I'm getting stuck, 
Do I like getting stuck? Not really. That we're going to leave and plow up because it's just so muddy out. I don't know what I'm going to do. When will we get sun? Tomorrow. But how long do I have to harvest wheat? I have until like August 1st, roughly. July. Okay, yeah, I have a good month, I'd say. In-game month. But, uh... Yeah, we're just gonna slowly drive to the grass, then creep up to the road, and then f hop on the road, drive to the next field, and then slowly creep to where I have to start harvesting. See, look at that. I'm going zero miles an hour. This is just not good. Hold on, what happened if I go in low gear? Can I go faster? Nope. Yeah, yeah. I can actually move. Yay. I didn't make it out, did I? I made it out? Wow. Life is full of surprises. I wish there's a way to, like, buy a semi with a triple axle and then put the, or put, like, lock four-wheel drive or put posse in. Compared to just kind of sliding around in this mud. It doesn't make life easy when you you have the mud. Like, I, I don't know how to say it, really. You, you kind of have to play the game, which I think a lot of people who watch this channel do play this game. Because, yeah. So we're going to go ahead, turn, get stuck in this ditch by hanging the header on the ditch. And, yep, possibly, nope, nope, we're going to have a serious problem. Unhook it. I definitely just unhooked it that fast. I didn't have to get all the cab or anything and unhook a PTO or anything. Let's just zoom in right here. Go ahead on, if I can. Hold on, it's saving. Alright, so... Just kind of zoom in right here. Connect. I hit connect already. That didn't work. Connect. There we go. Okay, there we go. Yep, there definitely isn't a PTO over here. Come on. I'm not sure if you can see it on the bottom. Or the bottom. Uh, I think it's like right corner. There's definitely not a PTO hooked up or any latches. So we're just going to go ahead and drive away. Raise the head up. And hopefully not go in the ditch, which I think I'm failing at. Oh yeah, I failed. I failed at not going in the ditch. I guess we'll have to. I'll have to make it a tradition. Going in the ditch. That's how I check my water moisture. Or my water levels. I don't buy a rain gauge. I just go in the ditch and see how much water. I use the tires and put Sharpie on the tires and then just <laughs> just put Sharpie on the tire and then just drive up to the into the ditch and well you'll see and then your tire will go ahead and you can get out your cab and look at me I'm stuck. Comment down below if you're surprised I got stuck a little there. 50% says probably not surprised. Well, we're just going to continue and combine. This is why I stopped combining in this field. If you can look over here, where it's, ah, my sensitivity is too high. Okay, right back in here, the hill, that's just such a pain because when it's this muddy and then you try and get on that hill, the head hangs up on the hill, and then you can't get out of there. So I'm going to have to, like, leave a lot of this for some other time, sadly. So, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do. But around, like, 30 minutes, 35 or so, I'm going to go ahead and take you guys down to that house and look if there's enough time in this video. I hope there is. I bet there will be. We're only at nine, 20 minutes. So, yep. Okay. 
When will I learn to stop touching the screen? Never, probably. Oh, well, let's just... Um, the house I'm going to look at is right by the milk plant. I thought it was a nice house, so I thought I might buy it and move in that. Just saying you can't buy it. Uh, you can't buy it exactly. I'm just going to... It's kind of... I'm just going to... I'm, I'm making air quotes right now. You just can't see them. I, I'm just going to air quote, move into it, I guess. I wish, like, for harvesting corn or, like, wheat on this game, there's stubble. Like, there's no stubble right now. When I go over it, there's no stubble. I wish there was some kind of stubble. Like, on FS19, there's stubble on it. It's like this little thing when you... Because then you can put your tire on it, and then you get a little more traction if it's corn. Which is something nice. Especially when you're driving a two-wheel uh, two tractor... Uh, Two-wheel drive tractor with a wagon. Anywho. Let's just keep creeping at five miles an hour. Let's speed it up to six miles an hour. Wow, that's the fastest I've ever seen all day. Yep. Oh, ten? Wow. That is very surprising. Oh, yep, slowing down right now. Raise the head down. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Just gonna keep driving. Harvesting wheat. For decades. The combine's at 11%. And I'm lost in the forest of wheat. It's so high I can't even see over it. See? Can't even see over it. Can't find the truck. I'll never know when to stop. I could hit something like this. Except the yield is so good. I finished almost half a field with this tank. I don't know how much I finished actually. But I finished a good amount. And I'm at 13%. That's the best yield I've ever had on wheat. I've never planted wheat before other than this time. So yeah. <laughs> Forty percent moisture. We're gonna sell this right to the elevators or mill right away because I'm not putting this in my bin to dry. Why? I'm not paying for that gas. No, no, no. Cause why pay for it if I'm just gonna sell it eventually? When what's the price at? Market. Hence, come on. There. Oh, the price is kind of sad. You know what would make the price happy? Going up a couple hundred thousand dollars per percent. That would also make me very happy. <laughs> That'd kind of make it almost anybody happy, I guess you could say. So, oh, there we go. I'm getting kind of hung up on a hill. I was kind of, not exactly. There we go, okay. You're gonna keep going slowly. I was just come some kind of auto steer on here. Just kind of like pull auto steer, hop out of the combine without having to pay for a worker or a hired hand. I, I just don't want to be. Cause did the I could be doing something so much better, and easier than this. That that this is just now uh, just too slow. I'd rather be driving the ATV around hunting or something. Eventually I'll do that, like towards the winter more. I'll kind of plow the roads, make sure everything's done, make sure all the farm work is done. I'll load the AT up, um, ATV and the Ranger up in the, the... Okay, I'm stuck almost. Okay, never mind. I'll load the ATV and Ranger up and pick up into the uh, small trailer, my skid steer trailer. And then I'll go ahead and go to a hunting stand and, yeah, hunt. And, yeah. Okay. Just going to kind of creep around the turn. Drop the head down. But all I know is, oh, yeah, of course, I dropped the head down at the worst time. 
Ever since I got Among Us, my sister wanted Among Us, my other brother wanted Among Us, my other sister wanted Among Us, now my older brother wants Among Us. Well, he doesn't want it. He, he just kind of wants to... He, okay, let's just put it, he kind of wants it in a way. But, like, because my sister got it today and my brother, my little brother, and then they're, they're all liking it, so kind of that's all we've been playing, which is why I ain't got nothing done on Farming USA, too. Which is kind of the original. I mean, you, you're you not going to get much more original than this. Mostly on my channel, because I only have... Okay, this is probably sad. I, I'm the maker of this channel, and I think most of you watchers know how many videos I have, and I don't. I think I have like four or five. Comment down below if I'm right. Because, hold on, let me count. I made like... Two Farming UC tours. Uh, that was like four that one day. No. There was a. That was the one I tipped over the semi. And I'm stuck. Um, then I made that one. Okay, I made three that day. Plus the Minecraft. And the Among Us. So that means I made about four or five, yeah. And then this one should count about a six or, or five or six, yeah. And I keep getting stuck. Wahoo, I keep getting... Kind of down below, stuck. Yeah. Because this is something I'm not sure any farmer wants to do. This is also not good for the equipment. Not the mud, I'm talking about... The mud isn't either, but I mean like raising the head up and down. Because on our farm, it's a dairy farm, we don't have combines, just like a chopper. Except, just look at them tires spin. If there was four-wheel drive, I'd... oh, that's why. I wish there was like a way to adjust the height on the head. Because look at this head, it's kind of lifting up the front of the combine. See that? Comment down below if you can see that. I mean, that that's just not something you want from a combine. Should have talked to the John Deere dealer guy before I bought this thing more. I'm probably going to finish this field, take you guys down to the house. Others, you guys are just going to be sitting through more of this sadness. Just kind of sitting here and slowly cruising along, getting something done. I'm not sure I'm going to see getting something done because, I mean, just look at this. And then, if you guys want me to, like, talk and everything, if play, like playing FS 2019... I could do it, and I'm not saying it's going to be easy. I'd have to get a phone somehow and make a different channel or upload it to my tablet or email it to my tablet, post it on YouTube, because I'm not going to make one more. Uh, I'm going to like take my or take a phone, because right now I'm playing on a tablet, because that's what I have, basically. I don't have a phone. But uh, I'm going to take a tablet, or I mean my, the f a phone, because that's easier to film other than a tablet. A tablet's just too big. And I'm hold it up, like, by the computer, so you can see the computer. And it's not going to be as good as you guys probably want it, but I guess it'll have to do. So comment down below if you guys want me to play FS 2019. I can't make any promises or anything about that, so yeah. And since I'm going so slow, um, hold on. Okay, I'm back. Um, the knocking on the door was just my sister. She wanted to play with a ball I got. So, um, if you guys ever hear, like, kind of, like, screaming kind of down the hall, that's just my brother playing Among Us. He's five, and I'm not sure he's real good, so I, I'm guessing he's dying or losing a lot as an imposter. Or venting when there's literally some guy right across the hall or in the same room as he is. Someone kind of has to teach him some of the rules because I'm not sure he understands so when to vent and not to vent. I can literally take you guys over to the room they're playing in, but I, I feel like he's not. He's gonna he he's gonna like get away or something because he's not too happy. Like he, he loves being the imposter. I mean, who doesn't? It's just it's one of them times where. You get to be the imposter like five seconds or so. He literally gets in the game, run. He's in the cafeteria, 
He runs right over to the vent, hops in there, and then everybody just calls an emergency meeting. And he kind of just, they, they all know it's him because it's kind of obvious. I could show you what he does if I ever make another Among Us one, which I bet I will. Um, so I'll show you guys the house, which I am almost there right now, honestly. Right down here, see the milk plant? It's at this, like, big factory-looking thing. Oh, that was a close one. All right, here it is. Okay, stop right there. Get out. Eh, they won't hit the back. If they do. If they do, they might be in the hospital for a while. All right, here's the house. Like it, guys? Comment down below if you like it. Anyways, I'll take you guys inside. Let's come up on the porch. Okay, so here's the inside. I know it's not the best. I, I've I've seen better. Got the bathroom back here. Then you got the stairwell over here, like to go upstairs. That's right here. And then the diner dining room is like right in back in here. In the kitchen, you can see as you can see, it's like right up in here as you walk in. And yeah, got an upstairs. See, yeah, nice house. Comment down below if you like it. But there's not much privacy. As you can see, the walls are clear. Okay, so. <laughs> um, <laughs> well, I'd, I'd go. Also, this is the only house you can do that. Uh, yeah. It could use a couple more, uh, like, updates or whatever you want to call it. Or could use a little more fixing or debugging or whatever. Because look at this. Bleh. I mean, I just walked right through a wall. It's almost like you're a ghost in this house. And then you can't go in your garage. If I could go in the garage, that'd be nice. Just park the truck in there. And I live right across the road from a church. Can I go in the church? Probably not. The, 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 I don't know why I can't go in there. Same with all the other houses. This is the only house. This is no mod or anything because I don't know how to get mods. Um, I do and I don't. Um... But yeah, I think this will be the end of today's video, guys. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe. And uh, comment down below. Turn on the notifications. And yeah. Uh, tell me what you guys think about this one. I'm, I was thinking of doing this. I'm not sure. Never mind. It, it's kind of weird. Uh, it's kind of stupid, dude. It's something about like leaving a like and then... Every time you leave a like, they'd find another uh, food item to go with ranch dressing. Comment down below what you guys like to go with ranch dressing. Me, it's more cucumbers and pick, uh, cucumbers and carrots. I feel like that's a lot. Um, it's probably the most original thing. And wh why did I start this conversation? I don't know. So, see you guys in the next video. Hope you have a good day. Okay, in case you guys were wondering why my voice was pausing, it's because right now it's night outside. And I was like, I hope you guys have a good day, even though it's night. I, 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 there we go again. Um, <laughs> I don't know how to really explain it. Okay, hope you guys have a good day. There, that's better.